for Album Sheet. Is it Bignum? Sorry? Is Bignum normally the mid player for Album Sheet? He is normally the carry player. Okay. So, so. stands the reason. It's probably unlikely. Maybe maybe we see one like, like the... Yeah, it does give you the ability to control the rooms, though. Because you can scoot yeah. around so quickly, and if you have the bottle, you can kind of spam it willy-nilly. Uh, we'll see, yeah. though. Down bottom, this could be an easy first blood. Big Daddy with a beautiful fissure blocks out Big Numb. There's nowhere for him to go as he stutters back and forth. ...for the engagement there, and he will just TP to the Tier 1 tower. Now he's hidden in the trees, and this could be another kill. Fissure comes out, connects on two. No fear, gets completely blocked in. Kuroki will get a lot of charges from this static link. It's level two, and the heal comes out on Shikiro. He'll eat a tree to try to move around, but it's just not enough. He knew an arrow would come in, so... There's no Mirani, he lives there, but unfortunately they're gonna die bottom blank and another kill. Kuro. Big Daddy in a decent position here to set something up. Show me is pressing decently far forward. Only the level one time walk. It doesn't really have that much range on it. He walks right by him. He gets pinged out, and now show me he goes. Uh oh, Chronosphere Sunstrike. This should be a kill under the uh, Earth Shaker. Yeah, they'll bring down Big Daddy, but maybe some counter kills coming out. Doom used on show me. Big Num's there with the heal, but I don't think it'll be enough to keep him alive. Upheaval gets channeled, and one more auto attack from Simba should be enough. Can he find the deny on the Ancients? Yes, he can. Well played by the Faceless. I think Album Sheet, like, they still have potential to turn this game around. Like, they get a good fight or two with a Chronosphere. They've got the pushing power from the Jakiro Liquid Fire. Um, surprise he hasn't gone for the Macro Fire, but they can definitely bring down Tower Fire. Yeah, up top, they'll find Warlock. Fissure right into Arrow. Beautiful setup from Secret. Kuroki will steal a lot of damage, has enough to bring him down. Big Daddy caught in the Chrono alongside Puppy. The Sunstrike is on the money, but Kuroki on the backside cleans up the two supports. Five hit points to spare, that. something like that. Fishes with an arrow, just barely misses. No fear comes in, looking for the kill, but he'll bite off more than he can chew once more. Connects with an ice pass, but the fissure does slow him up, and now DP should be able to bring him down. Cryptor hits him, and Big yeah, Daddy does up. have a fissure in a few seconds, so even if he survives for a moment longer, should have enough to bring him down. On top now, Simba with the Doom ulti on the Ink Visitor. Plasma Field hits, and that'll be one last fire. Not much the level six Skywrath could do, just on brown boots and a couple of null tallies. He'll uh, float his way back to safety. That that was a bit uh, fortunate for 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 Jakiro. Jakiro was doing like he and, and before those two deaths, both of those recent two deaths were both very avoidable. He was doing great. He has got a lot of levels, decent farm, but those two deaths both very unnecessary. Oh, Chrono on three, Mystic Flare on the puppy, enough to bring him down. The Sunstrike hits Big Daddy, but the mech from outside the Chrono keeps him alive. Big Daddy with that Echo Slam to so uh, soften him up, and Faceless Void will fall. That's just a misplay. That, that's really sad. Sad story. Poor Invoker. Well, show me. Chrono at the ready. He comes in. Chrono on two. But they've got a Yule outside. outside of the Chrono, and show me will just be forced back. Takes a silence as well. There's a fissure to block him out, and he'll be the first to go down. Now off to the side. Bob finds a kill onto the Marana. But Big Daddy chopping him down, and Plasma Field will be there to finish him off. Uh, the Invoker will be some sentries down, so they need to be a little bit careful. But Big Daddy blinks forward, finds no fear with the Fissure. Follow-up isn't there. Big Daddy takes the silence. And now how's this fight going to transpire? Doom's there, pops it on the Chrome. A Chomi, oh no. The Void, the one hero that they don't want to be Doom will fall. Chaotic Offering comes out, but does next to nothing. Warlock gets picked by Fissure. Big Daddy ends up falling to the power of the Golem, but he will buy back, and the only problem here is Hero, hero Skyrath here. Bump he wants the to kill the puppy. Can he do it? Bump the Skyrath. Yes, he can. He oh, doesn't no, have mana for the Mystic Flare. Oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> Second charge. Razor. He is got about 4,000 gold. If he wants a PKB, he can pick it up if he wants something else. Yeah, pretty much whatever his heart desires. Puppy will get picked off to the side, but Big Daddy's there with the Echo Slam. Show me gets stunned up once more. Chrono Sphere's available, but just can't use it. They've got the lockdown, and now no fear. Falls to the eye of the storm. Another one for two trade, a five. Now Warlock has his ultimate side. available. He yeah. ranged Rax, off to the side. Whoa, no fear, he's outside of the base. But Fissure will kind of zone him out, and... Range tracks have already fallen. Range Melee will be the next target of choice. Attack. Reebok, Chromie coming in with those fast feet. Chrono on two, S4, and Kuroki. Even the big rock from the sky flies down, but not enough to secure the kill. Ink Visitor and Shakira have both gone down. Bob outside of the base. Looks like he'll fall. Puppy almost goes down. The Fatal Bonds will finally bring him down. Kuroki's just too damn big, though. He still has the Aegis, and it's a one for five trade. Well. Wow.
Bob doing Bob things there at the end. That was, that was a, a rough game for an album sheet, but I, I think Team Secret, when they get like this Doom Razor, they just, that's like their comfort zone. Like, fly, I mean, at least as far as I've seen them use this combo, I mean, not even a combo, just use these heroes effectively so many times, and uh, the, the Death Prophet as well. Uh, S4's been playing Death Prophet left, right, and center. He has, he 